books are divisible into two classes, the books of the hour and the books of all time. John Ruskin. Once upon a time, a beautiful girl was reduced to being a household servant by her jealous stepmother and cruel stepsisters. They called her Cinderella. The announcement of a royal ball for all the fair maidens in the land sent the household into a frenzy. But poor Cinderella knew she would never be allowed to attend. With the help of a bit of magic from her fairy godmother, Cinderella was given a beautiful dress and a magnificent coach with the stern warning to return home by midnight when the magic spell would be broken. At the ball, Cinderella captured the attention of the handsome prince and the two fell deeply in love. Fleeing the ball at midnight, Cinderella left behind only a romantic memory and a delicate glass slipper. The prince and Grand Duke searched far and wide for the mysterious maiden. With the help of her friends, and to the dismay of her jealous stepmother and stepsisters, Cinderella's true identity was discovered, and she and Prince Charming lived happily ever after. Hello, I'm Paige O'Hara. The origin of the story many of us know today as Cinderella can actually be traced back to a 9th century tale from China. The legend is known in almost every country around the world. There's a famous version from Scotland called Ration Coty, an Italian cat Cinderella, the Brothers Grimm's Ash Girl, even a Nigerian folktale called The Maiden, The Frog, and The Chief's Son. In fact, more than a thousand versions of the Cinderella story have been recorded and cataloged worldwide. Why is the Cinderella story so treasured around the world? It's probably because of Cinderella's clear-cut moral. The way you act toward others creates its own reward, or sometimes its own punishment. And with a little bit of hope, dreams can come true. Walt Disney based his film version of Cinderella on the most famous Western telling of the tale. French author Charles Perrault's Cendrillon, which was published in 1697 in his History of Tales from Times Past, a book that began the written history of the fairy tale. And that's the story behind the story.